Here we have it, man. We got. What did y'all think about the main event? Let's talk, Mike and Roy. Hey, hey. First off, disclaimer: we watched it all separate. We were none of us was together. That's true. true. So just want to let everybody know. <laughs> I did have somebody show up at my house. <laughs> you know that's different. But uh, that was the event. Uh, Mike and Roy went better than I thought. Way better than I thought. Uh, I didn't expect much from it, honestly. So I was entertained. Uh, my buddy that came over was not. He wanted Mike Tyson from 1997. <laughs> he wanted him to knock him out. He wanted he wanted Roy Jones to be in and out moving like Roy thought he was doing that for a second. Yeah, he did, like, well, yeah, he did, Roy, what you did. doing? Yeah. What you doing, Roy? <laughs> uh, but he wanted all that. I said, man, it's, they don't got that no more, man. Uh-huh. He was uh, totally upset. I was entertained, man. That was entertainment to me. Yeah. Just two old guys out there wrestling over yeah. the barbecue grill. I'm, I'm, <laughs> you ain't got nothing on the grill like I do. Like they, just two uncles, man. Two drunk uncles. That's I how thought, I start, right? Hold on, put my yeah. meat on first. <laughs> no, I got the hot links today. Yeah, yeah. I thought the, uh, I thought Roy was worse than I expected, and Tyson was better than I expected. Really? Great, great. That was a great. That was great, Sean. Yeah. That was true. Because I thought because Tyson thought was, stuff. you could see he took it seriously. He was he was moving. He was throwing he shots. Was in he shape. Was even throwing combos. And Roy was like, he was rigid, and he'd throw a jab, and then like, kind of like try to get out of the way. Yeah. And and he was gassed after a round. Yeah. Tyson yeah, looked Roy like he could go fifteen round. rounds. Yeah. After the first round, they asked uh, Roy. They said, "I know you can see everything you're th- throwing, right?" He's like, "Yeah, kinda." Hey, he wasn't keeping it. He was keeping it real. Nigga, I'm tired out here. He said yeah, that? I, yeah. yeah. I didn't hear that. I, I was impressed by Tyson. I think Tyson took it seriously, and I, I was entertained yeah. by Tyson. And Roy, I think if Roy had taken it as seriously as Tyson, I think it actually would have been even more enjoyable because yeah. then Roy could have been throwing those shots and working on the, on the outside a little bit. And yeah. then, but it was, it ended up kind of being like at times one of those bad heavyweight fights where it's just a lot of holding, a lot of just kind of wrestling with each other. Yeah. But, no, Mike Tyson. Cons- he, there were a couple times where I was like, "Oh, you got some shots off there." I didn't even yeah. consider what uh, what either you just said until you just said it. But I I have to agree with y'all. I think that if Rory had taken it more serious, that mm-hmm. we would have had a much better fight, even cosmetically, just from the standpoint of those guys. If 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 Rory's determination and 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 pre- preparation matched. Mike Tyson, his body would have looked better, and and both guys would have looked a lot better in the ring, um, and so I, I think that that's the first X on it. But if we go back just a little bit to the to the pre fight uh, interviews, I thought both guys said some things that were that made a lot of sense. Mm-hmm. Uh, the one thing that that Roy said to me that I really appreciated, he said, "Listen, if if Dominique and and Mike were about to get on the court, y'all would go see them." He said, so why wouldn't y'all go see us? And I said, man, that that makes a lot of sense. These guys are iconic icons in the sport. They're legends in the sport and and, and athletic legends, too. I mean, Mm -hmm. let's be real. In their times, both guys weren't only known for being hellacious, uh, unbelievable boxers. I mean, especially Roy was was known for doing everything before and after a fight. You know what I mean? Getting on the courts and things like that. They were even beyond sports. They were just like icons. Yeah. Both of them, just yep. absolute global icons. Yep, yep. And then you, and then I think the separations right here, you do a pre fight interview with Mike and you say, hey, Mike, and, and post fight, remember. But he said, hey, Mike, listen, w- what do you got to prove? What are you doing this for? As Jim Gray's asking him, he says, man, listen, I'm a humanitarian. I just want to help people, I just want to give back. And that's where the separation was right there in the preparation. You have a guy who has a drive and a will that goes beyond eight minute, eight rounds, it goes beyond mm-hmm. two minute rounds. It goes further into how can I help people and, and how can I be a service to other people through doing what I do? And I think at the end of the day, that's what made me fast forward to the post fight Mike said Tyson man, won. Mike said <laughs> no, both hands were raised. I, I Tyson I won though. It. Anyone both who watched that, raised. Vinny Paz had they were showing Vinny Paz's score and he had like 
five, ten, ten rounds. I was like, come on, man. So hey, hey, the sports book said it was a draw. I'm so mad at Vinny. But, yeah, uh, I was like, come on, man. But Tyson won for sure. Yeah, I'll, I'll go back to my point a little bit later, but I thought that Roy won. I got, I got a Did score really card right here. I got a no, score you didn't. card right here. What, dude, what is he? Dude, dude. Carson. My score card. Carson, I don't know what he's we got to go solo. Listen. What is he talking about right now? Listen, make sure y'all subscribe to the channels, the Port Away Podcast and the Port no, Away Podcast. No, you can subscribe for that show. bullshit. I'm and, okay and, with you unsubscribing. And, and also, uh, uh, leave a comment. I have my scorecard right here. Uh, let me get a reflection. We right? can't see it. We can't no, see we it. We can see it. Go closer, closer. <laughs> it says, oh, it says yeah. Tyson won every oh. round. <laughs> oh, he got nine, ten, <laughs> ten, nine. Nine, There's no ten, way you thought, t- wow, that, you thought Roy won I'm that. Oh, that card. You can actually see it, though. You can actually see it. <laughs> There's oh, no way Sean. you thought Roy won I, that. I had, what you doing, bro? I had Roy Jones winning the fight. One, two, three, four, five rounds to three. Unbelievable. Carson. <laughs> Unbelievable. Who is this guy? I gave Roy maybe one round, and that was being generous. Really? Yeah. <laughs> maybe two. He was... He was did Roy throw anything other than a jab for the most part? Maybe. May, I think my mind was like, if he survives this round, I'm giving it to him. <laughs> he survived. I, mean, I was that, like, he was, survived tonight. <laughs> hey, those body shots. I assure you, Roy is waking up today feeling a lot worse than Mike is. Yeah. Hey, it was like, your, it was like you got kids, Sean. And it'd be like your kids are older. Old and the little ones. And you're letting the little, you letting the big one. Beat him down, but you're like, eh! hey, don't hurt him. The don't crazy hurt him. thing, the crazy thing about Roy is, God bless him, he really feels that he can do everything that he did in the '80s and the '90s. That was yeah. killing me. He look, he looking out to the side. I'm like, what are you doing? You ain't got that no more. It, 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 it looked worked like when it. you. It worked when you could do it. You just can't do it anymore. He looked like when you get the old he guy on the basketball effort. court. And to his aff- and to his defense, he he landed some really good jabs on 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 Mike. He did land some good jabs on Mike and a couple no looks on Mike, which is why I gave him the rounds that I gave him. <laughs> you know when you you but know when you play like, ball and you get the old guy out on the court that probably used to be like a stone cold baller and just come and down like, gunning it all the time. You yeah, like hold they're on, gunning it, <laughs> trying to do like behind the back passes, like. It's like, my man, this was probably great in the 90s, but that's what Roy looked like to me. Like, he looked like, oh, let me let me show you out of the razzle-dazzle that I used to do back <laughs> in my day. And it just, it was, it looked like an old guy. But Tyson, I, I, I was thoroughly impressed by Mike. Don't tell me you didn't enjoy what you saw because I know you did what you need to do now. Hit that subscribe button, hit the like, hit that notification button. Check us out every week, every Tuesday, something new for you right here on the Portaway Podcast.